If we have an infinite mm -hmm. amount of people behind me, would I ever get the chance to tap you on the shoulder? Is that a mistake or a banana? It's called banana. No, no, no. It needs to be very... I'm calling it banana. It's very... No, I'm being... I'm, I'm calling it banana. No, it's, it's called a banana. I'm, I'm being... I'm, you know what I'm doing? I'm just... No, no, I'm just dropping... I'm just dropping to your level. I'm calling it banana. Because you know why? Because you know why? You're just playing word games and semantics. I can say... I can say loads of statements as well. No, no, I'm not saying loads of statements. I just said one statement. I said banana. I can say actual influence. I can say loads of different It's not about that, brother. I'm going to give an argument for the statements that I say. I'm not going to come in here and just... Please, please, can you just answer this question that I asked you? Yeah. You said it's impossible for me to tap you. How? Can you just tell me? Ali, in your argument, you said you said just tell me how I can tap you in the head. No, 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 this is a I said it is impossible. This is a fallacy. You're giving me a fallacy. Okay, I'm giving you a fallacy. It's, Im it's impossible. Okay. You're going to accept to give me a fallacy? Yeah, yeah, I, I'm giving you a fallacy. Okay, it's impossible. Okay, but the Thank you. So there we go. As you can see, guys, oh, no, look, he, look, he, look. What do you mean? He's you can't saying what you're saying is a fallacy. Please, please, bro. Please, bro. So it's not up to me to do Bro, 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 sorry. Black belt's here. White belt's here. No, 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 one second, bro, bro, bro. Sabot, Sabot, no, no, no. Don't do injustice. I'm white belt. Okay. Okay, okay, listen. I'm, I'm listen, a nobody. I'm, 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 I'm Ali. Needs I'm, I'm, an, I'm an observer. I'm an observer. No, no, no. Ali, don't go. No, no. Okay, talk, talk to him. I just want to listen. You didn't answer his question. You didn't answer his question. No, no, no. I'm doing a student right now. Okay, I'm a student. I'm a student. I'm a student. Carry on, carry on, carry on. Here's my argument. My argument is the following, yeah? Yeah. I said to him that if I, in order for me to tap him on the shoulder, yeah? Okay. If I had infinite amount of people behind me, would I ever get to tap him on the shoulder? That's an argument. It's a statement. It's true. What are you saying is true? Let's just say it's true. What's the argument? The argument is an infinite regress is a fallacy. How? Because of the example you gave. Because of the so example he gave. Now, now I'm debating and I'm not debating it. So you run away. Oh, no, no. I ran away. I ran away. No, he didn't run away. You're too, you're too good. I can't handle you. No. Oh, too much. Too much. No, he, he made a valid point. Okay, no, wait, wait a second. Go. I'm going to argue his point. What yeah. he said was valid. Okay. So, first of all, just very quickly, don't do it easily because that's the better than the proof fallacy. I'm not saying anything about being possible or impossible. You're saying actual infinites are impossible. That's what you're saying. No, that I'm just going to carry on from the words he used. Yeah, but an infinite regression is an actual infinite. Yes, no. I, wait, wait, an infinite regression wait, wait, wait. Is an actual infinite? Let me, let me repeat. Let me repeat. I'm not interested in diverting the discussion. What he yeah, said... I understand. No, no, wait, one second. What, what, no, what, one thing. What he said, I agree with. Okay. So, what he said is that an infinite regression of causal events is going to be impossible. Yeah. So, it means it can never occur in reality. Yeah. Not in our reality, just in reality as such, okay? An infinite regression is an actual infinite. What do you mean? So it's going to do, be you, do you mean from a... Let's take like a mathematical. Let's take like a mathematical. Oh, oh, yeah, sure. Yeah? Sure. As, as, as an assumption, yeah. yeah. But then that means that if he's going to say, for example, that infinite regressions are impossible, well, then that's going to tell actual infinites are impossible also. That's, going to, that's just going to be a necessary intelligence. I think you're confusing I'm yourself, my friend. No, let me let, infinite regression no, I think, isn't actual Look, infinite. I think you just confused yourself. Right. Let, let, let me just explain right. something. What he just said right now, we're not talking about philosophically or axiomatically or pragmatically. We're right. saying right now in the real world, is it possible for that to happen? Yes or no? Yeah, so when we no, talk answer, about the, answer, answer the question. Yes, yes or no? So when we talk about possibility... Wait, 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 so yes, it's yes, possible. It is, yes, it is. When we talk about possibility... Okay, okay. Let's look. Let's carry on. I said in the, about, yes, in, the world, in the real world... Yes, in the real world... It's possible. In the real world, we deal with modality. And mo and mo and mo you're going to presuppose a particular type of modal... So a particular type of modality. What type of... What type, like, there's going to be different axioms that you're going to use when we talk about what is and what is not possible. So you guys here are going to sit here and you're going to presuppose a type of modality. What kind of modality are you using? I'm actually really confused about so what you're talking about. I feel your pain. Modality is huh? simple. I feel your pain. Modality yeah. is simple. <laughs> modality is simple. It's just going to be what we mean when we say what is and what is not possible. So I'm going to take it that, for example, you affirm that anything that's contingent can fail to exist. Right? Mm -hmm. So necessarily, it's impossible for something that's contingent to always exist. Okay, I th that's going to be okay. a type of modality. Right, let me just, let me just, so just let me just, world, world, sorry, my friend. Let me just step back. Very simple, All it very is, look, I didn't, oh, I just heard Ali say a statement to you and I just happened to stand here and then he chucked me in here. See, but, you just said you agreed. You no, 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 
Well, well, all I'm saying is, you haven't answered his question, and I've just restated his question. Do you think it's possible for the person tapping on the shoulder going back infinitely? Do you think it's possible, yes or no? That's irrelevant. It's completely right. That's irrelevant. Okay, tell me this. Tell me this. Wait, wait. Tell me this. Okay. If, okay. I'm just, I'm just going to make a statement. I'm just going to make a pure assumption. You have no idea how to even define a burden proof fallacy. Okay, fine. If I make a claim, does that mean the burden's on me? Okay, I hear that I'm going to show you wrong. The world is real. Is the claim on me? No, it's not. Because that's axiomatically true. It's not axiomatic. The world is real. Do you believe the world is unreal? No, no, I don't believe the world is unreal. Okay. That's not okay. So if I say, if I say, if I make the claim the world is real, is the burden of proof on me to prove the world is real? Yes. Okay. Yeah. How do I? Wait, wait, one second. One, like one second. One second. One second. Like that's that's not true. That's not true. true. That's not true. That's not true. That's not true. That's not true. Now, now I'm gonna now I'm gonna let you speak. Prove to me the world is real. No, that's the burden of proof, Alice. No, no, no. Prove to me the world is real. No, 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 no. How do you prove the world is real? You the world is real. You're just taking that as an axiom of your system. That's another thing you. Wait, wait, hang on. I made an assumption that you had no idea. How so the burden of proof fallacy works, and the way I showed it yeah. is by me making a claim a and you saying because I made a claim now the burden of proof is on me, yeah. and that means you simply don't understand how the burden of proof if fallacy you, works. If you make because because let me complete my reality, sentence because it is impossible to show the world is real. Okay, that's another claim. You, they, okay, show, yeah, yeah, show prove me, me wrong. Show me prove me no, wrong. No, you, no, prove you, me wrong. You can't, so what, you can because just, okay, wait, 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 wait. It is okay, impossible okay, philosophically. It's impossible okay, wait. philosophically for God to exist. That's a claim. Yeah. But that's exactly. Prove me no, no, no. Wait, excuse me. Prove you me have no idea what you're talking about. I, do. I don't know what you're grinning about. You wait a second. Wait a second, my friend. Look, when I'm talking to you and I have a spectator joining in. Who has no idea yeah, what they're talking yeah, about? Yeah, I'm just. Know, I know. Wait, 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 wait. I know in person. Who cares? Who cares? I'm having a conversation with my man. Bro, listen. You're laughing. You have no idea what you're know, laughing about. You're okay, wait a second. Wait a second. Listen. Wait a second. One second. One second. One second. One second, my friend. One second, my friend. One second, my friend. One second, my friend. I'm gonna speak to you, but let me just deal with the heckler. Let's turn to the crowd first. One second. What is the burden of proof fallacy? When you make a claim, it just falls due to Bruv, prove that Bruv, you claim. now don't know what you're talking about. Let me just ask you, what is the burden of proof fallacy? Once again, when you make a claim, the burden falls to you to prove that claim. For every single claim? Most yeah, every, yeah. Wait a minute, he just contradicted you. That's he said crowd. mostly. Hey, there we go. Do you believe in what he said or do you disagree with him? Huh? I disagree. You disagree? So your mate here who you are trying to defend, he disagrees with you. Okay, that's fine. That's so far. Far. And do you know what that shows you? Do you know what that shows you? Do you know what's funny about this? It shows he agrees with me. Because he said mostly. He said mostly. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. You're supposed to be helping him. Okay, that's fine. Why are you getting We're nervous for? Wins. Look at your face. We're not winning. You're getting all We're nervous. Winning. Flush an autistic guy. Good for you. What it is? What it is right now? Wait a second. 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 I just, I just want everyone to realize what's going on. Burden of why not? What's going on? What's going on? Okay, what's going on? Okay. So my friend Ali, what's basically going on? Come on. He's asking. He's another spectator. I want to know what's going on. Okay. I'm part of the crowd now. Sorry, brother. So this spectator who I don't know. Is asking oh, me the question. Know, the He's asking student. me the question. Oh, yeah, sure. What's going on? What's, What's going on is this. I was trying to make a point that the burden of proof fallacy is misunderstood by this gentleman. And the reason why it's misunderstood is because he believes all claims that are being uttered by myself have to have a burden of proof because I made the claim. That's what you believe. Yep. When I asked him that, he said mostly. Mm. So they disagree. Now I believe in what he said, which is it's mostly true but it's not always true meaning the statement all burden of proof is required for every claim is sufficiently false it's not actually true thank you okay that's got nothing to do with my argument of course it does no it doesn't of course it does it's about to be what he believes we just have different beliefs of what the burden of proof entails look let's just no say, no you don't okay, yes we of course you do okay let's just say for example just to further discussion can i can i let's just can i put it in other words no, no, no. Don't Can I put it in other words? No. Because you don't understand what no, I'm no, saying. I don't know. I'm saying just a further discussion. Let's just say I accept your definition of burden of proof. In this particular instance, how is What it? was the, I didn't give a definition of burden of proof. You said you agreed with what you said. No. Nope. You, you just saying. said you agreed no, no, with what no. you said. No, no, no. Wait, wait, one second. You just said one second, you one, 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 one second, one second. 
You said he agrees with you. Wait, 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 one second. There's a difference between the definition of burden of proof and what counts as some claim which requires burden of proof. Yeah, how is that? What's the distinction? Okay, the distinction is this. One is a definition. Here is how I define a burden of proof. And here's another thing which is all claims require burden of proof if they're being made by someone which is something he disagrees with and I disagree with. These are two different things. I never said what is my definition of a burden of proof. And shall I tell you something? I'm going to make a statement and it'll, it'll actually facilitate this discussion much easier. All claims being made by a person don't need a burden of proof. What's, up, what's the argument for that? Huh? What's the argument for that? Okay, I don't even need an argument for you that. Need an argument? No. So you just, you just believe because, in because, no, because. So you believe in Wait, wait, because, because, because. because look, no, wait one sec. Look, we're, we're doing things. Let me explain. Let me no, explain. No, no, let me look, explain. This is just let me, like, no, no, my friend, my friend, just like my friend. There's a really powerful trail of thought if you carry on with me. You will learn. Get the, you'll get a free I'm philosophy lesson. Okay. Now, if I make a claim, do I need to justify? Yes or no? Yeah. No. All claims don't need to be justified. Some claims need to be justified. All claims are going to negate another view. Do you not agree? Not you necessarily. Said, wait, okay, you, wait, hold on. You just roses are roses. What does that negate? Oh, it's going to negate that roses are not roses. Yeah. Oh. What do you mean? So let's say, for example, someone held the position that roses were not roses. You're going to name that. You're going to no, but that, that doesn't make any sense. You're saying, you're saying I'm, I'm saying, you're saying it's analytically one second, one second, one second. Wait, wait, hold on. You're saying it's analytically true that ro a rose is a rose. I'm not going to no, deny no, it. No, no, no. Mean you agree to that. I but said, my, my, my friend, my friend, here's what, here's what you've done. There's going to be some people that are going to deny the law of identity. To, right? to, sh to show I'm wrong, you've come up with a contradiction. Look, I'm so saying, you, I'm, saying, must, wait, wait, I'm saying, my look, friend, my friend, you're going to get free philosophy lesson. Please, one second. We're learning, we're learning. Just one second. One second. I said roses are roses. You said I can negate it through a statement. And what was your statement? No, no, no. I said, let's say someone, took, let's say, look, roses are roses is going to be analytically necessary. Right? Okay, no, no, no. Stop, 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 stop. Yeah, yeah. I said In roses are roses. roses. You said that can this be negated. Even, even and you got, you negated it by saying roses cannot be roses. No, 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 no. What did you say? No, 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 what did you say? No, 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 no,
Uh, the important point is important point every is, every claim doesn't require justification. That's what you believe. Yeah, wait, wait, because you're a foundationist. No, no, if, I, if I'm a foundationalist, what's the incoherent about my view? No, 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 something okay, okay about your view, but on my, like, let's say for example a coherentist, <laughs> they'll take a different position. They may be, I, it's not, they may be who cares? Then I mean, who cares? That's gonna that's gonna be a negation to their position. No, my belief. Yeah. Okay, no, tell me, tell so me this. My beliefs, no, no, no. So we're talking okay. about infinity. No. No. Okay, okay, okay. Look. We're not talking about anything Just. We're not talking about anything you give your honest perspective. If you disagree with me, you disagree with him. Here's the, here's the point I'm making. He made a point which I totally disagree with. He made a point. Everything requires justification. Every claim requires justification. Any positive ontological claim requires a justification. You, 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 you're adding some new Change. words that's in exactly, there, words exactly, in there, which, which exactly weren't there, what I'm which words were. Now, here's the point. Here's the point. Here's the point. Here, 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 yeah, yeah. Okay, 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 okay. So let me complete my statement. So I believe, my belief that every claim does not require justification. The foundational school, as espoused by Aristotle. That I believe is coherent, and I am subscribing to that perspective. Why am I wrong? So you don't question anything. Oh, you're not wrong on, on, the, on the foundation. Okay. That's no, it. that's the thing. It's two. It's two different philosophical schools. That's the whole point I'm trying to get to. You're not but I would say that like, the pro the problem with the contingency argument is that it doesn't. No, no, no. This is more about infinite regress. Yes. yes yeah. Yeah. So, so, so he was saying that, for no, example, no, no, uh, that for example, we cannot have an infinite regress. So if I said, for example, if I want to tap him on the shoulder. No, no, no. Of and, 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 I said, and I said to him, and I said to him, there are infinite amount of people behind me. Would I ever get to, to tap him on the shoulder? I said, it's possible. Yes, you can. And I said to him, how? And he was saying, all this much. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, no, I agree. It's, it's so, so, infinity. So saying, the thing is, infinity is not proven in our lifetime. So we cannot assert I'm, it. I'm taking, I'm taking infinity as purely mathematical. So is it, yes. is, is it possible? It's proven. Yeah, no, 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 is it possible? The problem is okay, when okay, we okay, deal with logic. Let me, ask, let, me, uh, let me just ask you one question. Look, the, look, you've been asking the questions. I have a question to ask now. I haven't asked any questions that I haven't No, no, you, you did, you did. I have, no, 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 look, no, I just have a very simple question. If there's an infinite number of marbles and I take away three marbles, how many marbles are there? Okay. Oh. So, so an infinite number minus three. You're saying the answer is infinite. So you have to assume a certain axiom. So, first of all, your do you, do you, do you see the problem there? No, there is actually. There actually isn't. Do you, you see no problem there? Actually, isn't a problem. Taking away from infinite is not a problem. Hold on, no, because I'm leaving the, the. You can leave. That's completely fine. So, if you if you understand, um, it's a it's it's a, it's, a, it's a particular idea of set theory where we have to make a distinction between the cardinality of a set and then like the set itself. And the cardinality of the set is not the set itself. So it's actually an equivocation when you say, oh, I'm going to take three marbles of the set, which is the cardinality, and the set itself. Those two things are not the same. So it's perfectly coherent. There's nothing, there's no problem there. You can really look this up. You can look up all the problem. Yeah, mathematically, there's no problem. Yeah, there's no problem. Yeah, look, yeah. look, look. So, so wait, 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 wait. So wait, Do you remember, no do you remember, do you remember no what I said to you? Do you, know no do, do you remember there's why, no John, do you, do you remember what I said to you before? We're not talking about something axiomatic or some assumption in maths, we are talking about in reality. In reality. Um, in, reality in reality, can there be an infinite regress of causes? Okay. Yes or no? I, I mean, me, no. I don't say a contradiction. No. So right now, I'm going to say. I'm going to say. I yes. believe no. Okay. So what's the I argue? believe no. What's the argument? The argument that Ali Dawa gave before? No, the you thing, know, you know, he an I infinite think, wait, wait, regress wait, 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 of causes wait, 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 is impossible. Wait, wait, wait. That, an that's infinite not an regress. Argument. That's, a, that's a claim. That's a no, that's an argument. No, that's a claim. No, the argument that he gave no, you no, he was based it. upon he tapping on the shoulder. Here. Here. I listened to it. No, 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 he didn't give an argument. That was an argument. No, no. He said, he said, if I were to go to you and tap you on the shoulder, would I ever do it? If there's an infinite. That's a thought experiment. That's not an argument. Why is that not an argument? He's just making a statement. What's no, that? he's giving you he's a giving rational you. argument. No, no, that's not an argument. Where are the, where are the premises? No, I just to... Wait a minute. Are you saying an argument needs to have premises? An argument can be one simple line. Oh, of course it can be one premise and then a conclusion. No, it doesn't. It doesn't even sometimes need to be a premise and a conclusion. It could simply. It could be a conclusion. You could simply. An argument you is just could, a conclusion. You, no, you could simply. No, you could simply make a claim, which is going to be self-verifying. Self-evident. Pretty much self-evident. Yeah. Look, if you say, for example, like, I'm not, Basic, wait, okay, I'm not going to disagree. I'm okay. Not, okay. Let's how, say, how about this? Let's how say, about, let me make a new oh, claim. Wait, 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 let me make a new wait, claim. Wait, 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 wait. Infinite regress say, of wait, causes wait, wait, wait. are impossible okay. in the real world. Okay. Okay. First of all, do you what, disagree with me? No. What's the argument? No. I am. Firstly, if you're saying, I'm, I'm not convinced. If, okay, okay, okay. 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 Cool. One second. I'm not convinced. What's the okay. Okay. Firstly. Don't say you're not convinced or not. I'm say not, yes or no. I'm not convinced. I don't know. I'm not convinced. Okay, you're not, okay you don't know. Okay. So if I was to say... You, 
you give me I think on the wait, 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 I think the problem here is my my friend my friend my friend my friend let me tell my 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 friend my friend let me let me no my friend let Okay, you're listen, see, listen to me. PSR, listen to me. Do you think PSR, examples PSR. are not arguments? No, I don't think, look, not necessarily. Do you think every single argument no, you can give needs me a premise, experiment. premise, conclusion? No, no, you can give me a thought experiment. I'm not going to deny you give me a thought experiment. Okay, so, okay, well, okay, one second. Please, Is a please, thought please. experiment evidence for you? Thought experiment can be evidence. Yes. yes. That's what I'm trying to give you. Okay, look. So, can I, can I continue my thought experiment? Yeah. Go ahead, go ahead. Okay. So, I want to catch the London double decker bus. I want to, uh, you know, give them a pound. Yeah. Okay. So I come up to this gentleman, I say, can I have a pound? He says, no, I'm going to ask Mansoor. Mansoor says, can I have a pound? Him, gonna ask and him. I've seen, I heard would I ever be able to catch the double decker bus if there's an infinite regress of causes, yes or no? I see no contradiction. No, I'm asking you from your perspective. From my perspective, anything so the only way that that event that set of events cannot occur is if it's impossible you agree what do you mean so say that again so the only way that particular set of events could not occur is if it is impossible I, I, sorry i catch the bus or i don't catch the bus so so it's impossible that, that you ever catch the bus yeah yeah okay now that means so if it's impossible it's going to entail a contradiction you agree not necessarily so wait, wait. it could just be there's a there's something there's something incomplete so if it doesn't have to be a contradiction. Wait, is it something in, so it's basically the distinction. I don't it's something, so. something is incomplete in the chain. So wait, what's not complete in the chain of him going to him and him? Okay, going to him so look, look, to, to make it very simple, I'm trying to break things down to as simple wait, as wait, as, wait, as simple wait, 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 examples wait, wait. as possible. You're saying for any for any set chain of contingent things, there's going to require, right, or even infinite things, there's going to require, let's just say, uh, a necessary first cause, thing. First cause. Yeah. So, if so, if so, if the, so, wait, so, if I was to take the bus. So that, wait, that's your claim, right? So then let's No say, no, it's not claim. I just gave you a okay, thought experiment, okay. which is wait, evidence. Wait, wait, wait. Which that's, is evidence. Wait, wait. That's going to presuppose that particular thing. I'm saying simply this. I'm saying simply this. To me, that's going to be any different from a contingent. You're saying that for any for any set chain of contingent things, it's just going to require a necessary course, a necessary first, like a first necessary first. Okay, I'm not dis. I, I'm you, not. You don't disagree. So, with so, so no, no, I'm not. Sorry. You don't I I do disagree with you, but I'm not disagreeing with you right now. I'm asking for clarity. Are you saying I can catch the bus? No, no, no. Well, no, well, well, no, no, no I'm that. asking a question. No, I think it's a distinction between uh, theory and practice. Look, I'm asking. Uh, I'm talking about. I'm talking about reality practice. Yeah. Can I catch the bus if there's an infinite regress of people that I have to ask for one pound? So, yes or no? I'm simply saying, in my view. But you're not answering my question. Okay, I was, look, for the sake of my answer, yes. Okay. The reason Ooh, why. I'm okay. This, fine. How? How? I'm how? This is because I don't see. Sorry. I don't see a contradiction in that set chain of contingent things. Okay. Now, the reason why I would say no is if it could be shown to me how that would be impossible. Because anything impossible entails a contradiction. That's why I, I think we both agree about it. I'm saying if that set of events was impossible, and is and you're saying it is impossible, then you should be you should be able to provide to me a contradiction. Now, either you're going to say, oh look, any chain of contingent things is just going to have a necessary first cause, which is going to be begging the question. That's a very that's a very like position that you hold, which I don't hold that, right? Or you're going to be saying to me something like, why would the first cause be begging the question? Oh, because that's the, that's a very that's a very claim. Your very, your very your very claim is that the reason why a god exists is the whole contingency argument is to prove that there are contingent there are contingent okay so and contingent firstly can, can, can you define what you mean by begging the question oh begging the question is assuming the conclusion in the premise okay fine that's okay. good so how am i assuming the conclusion in my premise yeah because if you think if you're saying that the premise is that no set cause of contingent things cannot exist without a first cause that is begging the question because your very conclusion is that all all things, all set contingent things that exist, it has a first cause for it. That's begging the question. I hope you know. It's, a, it's clear cut. How? Okay, it's clear cut. okay, it's no, okay, 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 wait, wait, wait a second. You're, you're, you need you're, to show me the contradiction. Look, look, my friend, here's what I'm really confused about. You're really confident, but you're really deluded. Well, look, tell okay, me how. Tell no, me how. No, I'll, I'll, I'll look, explain look, to you I've how. I've spoken to this no, loads of people. You all say my friend, same thing. my friend, I didn't interrupt you when you were espousing right. your views. Let me expose mine. Here's why you are super confident, super deluded. You're saying I can catch the bus, yes. Despite the fact there's an infinite regress of causes going back ad infinitum. Mm -hmm. That 
does not make any sense. Okay, so you're going to now have to tell me what. So this, now we're talking about modality. We're saying it's going to be necessarily impossible, right? That given that there is a fact about reality where someone is going to ask everyone else for a pound such that they can get cash to us, it's going to be necessarily impossible. Okay, that's what you're telling me, right? I'm saying it no, makes. No, yes, you're yes, saying I, it's necessary. No, 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 I wouldn't use those words. That is what's going to no, no, no. I wouldn't I use those use words. words. No, no, no. Because, because no, Charlie, why? Because no, 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 no. no. I'm going to ask what, you what kind of my, look, my friend, using. my friend. What's happening is so look, I don't want to tie myself to certain words that you're using because I'll have to get you to define what they mean. So rather, rather than that, rather than that, rather than that, right, rather than that. Is there a possible what, what, world in which? Wait, wait, wait. Is there a possible world in which an infinite regress of contingent causal okay. things can I, ever, okay, can I, ever, okay, any possible world yeah. ever reach its end? Okay. Is there a possible? Okay. World? Now, now I get what you see. Now I get. Now I get. Now, now, no. Now I get You're what you've done. You simply changed my example. I haven't changed your example. You have. Because it's no, metaphysically wait, impossible. wait, one second, one saying. second, one second. Oh, Here, away. here's why you changed my example. I said in this world, this. You said, is there any possible world in which that could happen? Wait, you you change my example. Are you saying just in this world? I'm asking about this world. Oh, so first of all, like, I'm a metaphysical realist. So I don't think that there are some things that can, that, that can occur in this world that cannot occur in another world. Like, for example, in every world that exists, contradict the law of contradiction obtains. Right. It's never going to be true in any other possible world that one plus one equals anything other than two. Right. So that's what I so that's the kind of modality that I'm going to use. Right. Now you're going to espouse to me a different type of modality. It seems to me that you think that, that you're saying something akin to like some like metaph metaphysical relativism. You think that there can be things that can be actual in this world, metaphysically speaking, metaphysically speaking. That cannot be actual in another world. No, that's what you're saying. No, that's what, no, you're, that's saying. what you're saying. That's what you're saying. Okay. I'm so saying metaphysically. My, 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 my friend, my friend, my friend. What's going to be true in this world is going to be true in every world. Let, 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 you're telling me something. No, 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 no. Let's, 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 let's keep it that. simple. Let's keep oh, it simple. Gonna... Let's go keep ahead. it simple. Go I can catch that bus. In this world. So in this world. Yeah. Even if there's an infinite regress of causes according to you. Yeah, because I don't see a contradiction. Okay. So that's unless fine. you want to remember. Look, From a contradiction, anything follows. No, 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 no. From a contradiction, no, no, anything no, follows? I never said it is a contradiction. I said I don't see a contradiction. You don't see that there is so something look, missing. Example, I don't see. No, no, no. But I mean, if you want to say that, if you want to say that, I don't see a contradiction. What? Okay. Look, I okay, don't see a contradiction. So, so I can catch the bus even if there's an infinite regress of look, causes look, going back, according it, to no, you. Hold on. Is it possible, for example? For You're the, not answering wait, the question wait, wait, again. No, I'm going to make it very simple. Is there a contradiction? I'm done keeping is it simple. There, is there a contradiction, for example, in saying that we can start from the number one? And the number one can, can can go up to number two, and number three, add infinite. Is there ever a point where any of those, any of the natural numbers don't like? There isn't a number that is like, that is like, like, like quantitative. That's a disanalogy. It's not a disanalogy. That's a total no, no, no. disanalogy. The reason I'm talking about contradiction. That's a total disanalogy. Dis I'm talking. No, no. How is no, that no, relevant here? I'm talking about me not seeing. Wait, 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 one second. One, sec one, one second. You're talking about no. counting numbers, ad infinitum. Wait. I'm talking about infinite regress of causes. First of all, first of all, this is chalk and cheese. No, no, no. First of all, both of those are instances of actual infinites. Open. No, no I yes, would say I would say in this yeah. case no. No, no, no. I would you say in this case. Wait one second. You ask me the question and okay. you want to answer it for so me. Not, okay, go ahead, go ahead. Thank you. In this case, I'm saying there is not an infinite regress of causes going back. So there's a contradiction. What's the contradiction? I didn't say there's a contradiction. No. If you I say said there is. There is, is not, I, wait, wait, one, okay, one, wait, one, one second. One second. One second. I'm saying there there has to be a cause which allowed that to take place. Oh, I'm not denying that there has to be a cause, but that's not your position. Look, that is my position. No, because we're talking about the Look, you are talking That I, is my position. Ali Dawa, wait Ali a minute. Came the the whole day. reason we're having this discussion. We're about a wait, wait. Argument, right? we're Let, about, let's, cut about let's cut to the chase. Let's cut to the chase. We're talking about God. We're talking about God. We're talking about God. We are talking about God. We're talking about God. You're talking about cause of finitism. Look, you're talking about the first cause argument for God denies causal finitism. Look, That's in this world, no, no, no. real, in this world, in this world, in this world, not in this, in this world. world, in all worlds. No, in this world. The reason why I'm saying... Well, then you're a metaphysical no, relativist. No, I'm argument? not a metaphysical rel relativist. But the, no, but the reason I don't want to get into that is because... Oh, look, you know this and I know this. Even today, we have certain things which in front of our eyes seems to be contradicting 
laws of logic, things like in quantum mechanics. No, what, what, tell me something quantum mechanics. Like that, that, that Certain interpretations, many world interpretations, Copernican many, interpretations. Many world interpretations. Wait, 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 of the observer the, bias, wait, wait. things acting differently. Okay. We you have, seem to be confused about quantum mechanics. I don't want to have, to have a quantum mechanical yeah, conversation with you, but nothing in quantum mechanics ever contradicts any of the logical, any of the three. According, to, other, according to some, they believe it does. Yeah, but they're just, they're, like who, sorry? That's the definition of it. Metaphysics. What are you talking about? It's not logical. No, no, no. No, 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 no. That's fact. That's not, you don't know anything. Let me continue. No, no, no. Let me continue. Look, talking about metaphysics. Look, can we cut to the chase? The discussions about God and you. about causal No, no, no. Wait one second, one second. We're not talking about God. I'm trying to do a bird's eye view. Okay, look, I'm trying to do a bird's eye view. Bird's eye view. Look, I know we're talking about the contingency. Okay. Which is a proof for God. Okay, yes. I agree. Yes. But the main, one of the one of the premises is that infinite regressions are impossible. Now, that's going to deny causal affinities. Right. You now need to provide an argument. No, and you know, I, I, gave, I gave a thought experiment. And guess what? I to, and I okay. told you, and I told you, that thought experiment does not work. No, no. Let's not show that your position no, no. is correct. That, because causal affinities has not been disproved. It's not okay. a contradiction. Okay, let's slow down. Let's, let's, let's slow, slow down, slow down. Is a thought experiment evidence for you? Let's just say yes. Yes, it is. That's not an answer. Yes, if you say, yeah, let's yes, say it yes, is. yes, it is. Yes, yes it, it is. is. Yes, it is. Yes, it is. So if I provide to you a thought experiment mm -hmm. in which I cannot catch something unless there is a cause, you didn't, you didn't show I, I gave you a thought experiment. You told me, would it ever be, would I ever catch the bus if I had to do X, 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 Y, Y, Y? And you never answered the question. Said, you never know. answered the question, by yes. the way. Yes. Okay. Yes. Yeah. What do you mean? Yes, it can go back forever. Yeah. How? Oh, now you made the claim yeah. and you said every claim needs justification. Yeah. Go ahead and give me evidence. There's no contradiction. No, no give me evidence. There's no contradiction. Give me evidence That's for that. There's no contradiction. Give me evidence. Yeah. No, no, no. So guess what? Don't guess say what? there's no contradiction because now, so, now what I'm going to do, yeah. Yeah. I'm going to change my standard for your standard. Yeah. Your standard was every claim requires justification. So you're the one that made a claim that this is possible. Yeah. How? Okay, so under my interpretation of, of modality. I don't care about your interpretation. We, well, I don't care about give your me evidence. You, you just give, give me so evidence. Don't care about your give me evidence. Your foundation is just no, no, I don't care about that. What's wrong with foundationalism? Oh, I don't care about. It. No, you see, you see, I decided when you No, no, no. Look, I'm, all I'm doing now, no, 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 my friend, I'm, a I'm taking your opposition. standard and yeah. applying it to you. Yes. Your standard yes. has to be applied so, to yourself now. Show me how it's possible for me to catch a bus if there's an infrared regress okay. or cause is going so, back. So I okay. over to you. So in modal logic, there's a particular axiom called the S fan axiom, which literally just says, if it is possible, right, that X, then it is necessary that. So it, then it's necessary that X. So let's say for example, X is necessary. Right? We know what that means. It's not, it can never fail to exist. Now, under my interpretation of modal logic, if it's possible that X, which, which X is that it's necessary, well then, it's necessary that X. Well, it's perfectly possible, in my view, that, that cause affinitism is true. Therefore, it's necessary. This is something which means there's no contradiction. Prove me I'm wrong. You didn't actually answer my question. I did actually answer your question. No, you didn't. I gave you the S what was my question? Logic axiom. No. You said, give me justification. You, you know what you did? Well, how do I, what did I do? All you simply did is you espoused what your view is in modern logic. So yeah, that's the just. But so ju my friend, so my friend, my friend, my logic friend. No, 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 no. You didn't complete oh, the circle. You didn't complete the yeah. circle. We're, we're talking German and. No, no, no. We're not. We're, we're, we're speaking in, English and English. We're speaking alien language. What's basically going on now? I'm gonna keep silent. Continue your just justification. Yeah. So do you, do you deny or affirm the S5 model? No, no, no. I'm I'm waiting for you to complete your justification for the claim that you made that yes. Yes, I can take that bus even if there's an infinite regress. Carry on. So, remember, I'm simply saying that there is any in modal logic, what is going to be possible is going to be possible if and only if it doesn't contradict something in the very nature of reality. Okay, for example, I don't think, for example, like Moses splitting the sea is impossible. That's perfectly metaphysically possible. Nothing in nothing within the actual fit, like logical laws of reality say anything about how Moses cannot split the sea. Jesus walking on water. That's not impossible. That's perfectly possible because there is no contradiction for that to occur. So I, I like if there was evidence given to me, I would believe that. I don't care. Look, it's perfectly possible. Now I'm gonna hold that position. It's gonna be the S5 modal logic position, right? It's an axiom of the modal logic that. Given that something does not entail a contradiction, it is therefore possible. That's my position. Now, if you're saying that, it, that it, the S5 axiom is false, go and deny S5 modal logic. Go ahead. That's my that's my justification. Wait, modal logic mm -hmm. you're using the to S justify yeah. the fact that 
I can take the bus despite an infinite regress of causes. So remember, in do you feel? Wait. Do you feel you've answered the question sufficiently? So I, make a very I don't think you have. Okay. So what you've done now is this. I'm actually going to zip my mouth and I'm going to ask you. I'm going to rephrase. Okay. Are you a moral absolutist? Sorry, uh, metaphysical absolutist. You believe that it's true. Whatever's true in this world, metaphysically, is true in every single world. In terms of like necessary axioms. Yeah. yeah. You do. Okay. Good. So you believe it is possible for me to take the bus despite an infinite regress of causes? Yes, you do. No, 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 let's just say, you say yes. Now, I'm going to keep quiet. You show me that that is possible. Okay, for the last time, for the very last time, in a modal logic, okay, in, in a modal logic, okay, there's going to be, modal logic is all about possibility and necessity. You agree to that, right? So we're going to have different types of senses of what we mean when we say possible and necessary. Now, I'm going to take that anything is possible if and only if it is, so yeah, if and only if, it, so something is possible if and only if it can obtain in some way, right? So for example, it is possible, it's impossible for you to come here and not wear this coat. That's perfectly possible, right? Because it doesn't entail a contradiction. So anything is possible insofar as it doesn't entail a contradiction. Now, it's not necessary that you wear the coat. Okay, right? so, can you say that again? Anything is possible if and only if, if and only if it does not entail a contradiction. Okay. Within itself. Okay, okay, one second, one second, one second. Sorry. If Anything is possible. Okay, you and me, we both agree. If right now I hit my fist on the floor and you get a gushing spring, yes. that is logically possible. No, metaphysically. Me okay, metaph metaphys 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 metaphysically possible. However, that metaf metaphysical possibility, which we have from a framework perspective, which allows many, many types of things, does that mean that that happened? In the real world. Okay, you're getting confused. No, 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 I'm not. No, I'm not. not. I'm actually no, now. I'm actually getting. I'm, no, I'm actually now showing you confused. where your gap is. Look, wait, 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 one second. 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 The reason you're getting triggered is because you've realised where the gap is now. Okay. Very. I, my friend, you, my, my, friend, my, my, my friend, my friend, my friend, my friend. No, don't worry, don't worry. He's. Trust me, he knows what he's talking about. He's got a whatever PhD in whatever. <laughs> right. I, 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 yes, yes. You, you are talking about quantum mechanics, and you said that quantum mechanics. We were earlier. We were earlier. We were earlier. You said that there is no logically inconsistent thing. Obviously, there is. Obviously, if, if you if you look at uh, quant the observation in quantum mechanics, your logical way of thinking, what you have perceived or taken as common sense and then you metaphysically extrapolate that, that will obviously violate quantum mechanical sense. That will not work there. Okay, so, so let, so let me confused. give you, let, let me give you, there's a distinction. Another thing, another thing, another between thing. Our, 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 yes, yes. Let, our let, 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 let me, you make a logical possibility. Yes, it's true that I'm I am saying that. Yes. That's, that's what I'm what saying was saying to you. You just admitted to that. You just contradicted yourself. That's exactly what I said to you and that's why he bumped in. Sorry, sorry. You just contradicted yourself. He said there are logical things that are disproving logic. I didn't say disproving logic. I, I said I said they're going against what we believe to be logical. Yeah, that's not okay. okay. Our perception of it, and you just agree to okay, that. Wait, you, and you carry on about this because now you get. Bro, he studied quantum mechanics. He's got a PhD. He'll school you as well. Carry on. Unicorn is equal to unicorn. It is self consistent. Unicorn is equal to unicorn. It is self consistent within itself. Does that mean unicorn exists in possibility? Look. When you said logical, I thought you meant no, no, like no. Tell me, tell me. No. So you misunderstood what I said. Have we meant intuition? I agree that in in, in quantum mechanics, um, um, there are going to be a lot of things that are going to be unintuitive. We don't disagree. I agree. That's not logic. That's I'm not, not saying it disproves logic. I'm saying it goes against what we perceive no, to be logic. No, we no, that intuition, that. not logic. What do confused. you mean? Like for example, I have I have like intuitions all the time. Like one of my intuitions is that when I walk down a road, the floor is just going okay. to collapse. Logic Can you subscribe? Okay, one, one second, my friend. I know you're talking but about No, my friend, my friend, you don't. My friend, you don't. My friend, here's how... 
No, we, we do disagree. Okay, listen, can you can logic. you can you explain Young Slit experiment and why it goes well, I against? Know about it. That's got no, 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 logic. no, no, no. It does, does, it 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 does. No, it does, it does, it does, it does, it does. Please, please explain why it does. Listen, he has a PhD in physics. He can explain. Tell me. Remember, not intuition. It goes against intuition. Explain Young Slit experiment. I know the double slit experiment. Yes, I know that. When you fire photons down down two slits. For example, it has it has a particular way in which it, in which it occurs. But then, when we add a measurement to it, instead of it instead of it working like particles, it becomes a wave. That does not contradict logic. It contradicts intuition. They're not the same thing. You you don't know what you're talking. No 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 no. You don't know what you're talking about. No no. no, 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 no let him let him speak. I studied this. You let, don't know. Let, let, let him complete, and, and then I'm going to speak. Tell me, and I'll tell you. If you observe a single photon, yeah, then you will identify that. Uh, with, with, uh, in which so which 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 sleep, let him please speak. In which sleep it is passing. Yes. Now, so you you know that which path is taken by that. Yes. You know that. Yes. But again, when you summing that up at, at the observation point mm -hmm. at, at the screen, mm -hmm. then you you seeing the nature that it is everywhere. Mm -hmm. So your calculation says that it is not like that. It was everywhere. So your calcul calculation mm -hmm. to explain the result. It needs the assumption that the photon was actually everywhere. But if you observe, oh, no, no, you yes. confused. Do you know you're that? Bro, he has a PhD in no, no, quantum mechanics. No, no, this is why. This is why you shouldn't be talking about quantum the, mechanics. Do you know the path integral approach okay. of quantum mechanics? No, do you problem. know the quantum this coherence? Is the problem with science no, no, is those no, no, no. I'll no. tell you this. This is the problem. So you are well, talking well, about philosophy of science. That's the whole point I'm so talking about. Based on when we talk about, when we talk about, when we talk about, okay, yes. okay, yes. Talk about one at a time, one at a time, one at a time, one at a time. Okay, let me speak. You, when we talk about determination, there's an equivocation of it. There's one thing in determination. So in determining our knowledge of where the particle is, and then the knowledge of where the actual particle is. So, so, sorry, where the actual particle actually resides. Okay. For example, superposition is only about our knowledge about us not knowing where it is. So possibly. It is everywhere. That's what superposition says. And we agree. He's not saying no, possibly, no, no, he's no, saying no. it is. Yeah, that's it false. is. Okay, okay. Yeah, how do you know that? Okay, okay, okay. Let him speak. 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 My friend, my friend. But don't talk to him. Let him speak. Let him speak. So, Casimir effects proves that the quantum fluctuation is real. You know? That means quantum fluctuation real means uncertainty is real. And that means what is uncertainty? Well, let him speak. Let him speak. Let him speak. My friend, knowledge. my friend, no, he no, didn't interrupt. Nothing you. to do with the limitation. My, my friend, my friend, let him speak. Yeah, exactly. My friend, nothing we know with the limitation. Okay. Let, let, one at a time. Please, please, please. Complete, 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 complete your point. Complete your point. Why? Look, I want to get back to our little. No, no. Do you know why? Because you made a false statement about quantum mechanics, and randomly, randomly, we had somebody who has a quantum mechanics background contradicting you. Well, you saying you're not scared shows you're scared. About quantum mechanics. Speak to. Him and let him speak to you. Go, you go, let them speak to I, I suggest you go to the book of modern quantum mechanics by Shakurai, Jesus Shakurai. Read the first chapter. Okay, then come back. I will discuss. But you you are having a classical view of quantum mechanics that it is so you limitation of measurement. No, nothing to do with limitation of measurement. It is by nature that. It is the quantum reality is by nature like this. That. Now, what are we talking about? Let, 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 let. No, 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 because okay. that's the point I was no. making. Okay, let's take a quantum. No, no, wait, 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 wait. Let him complete his point. Let him complete his point. So, let him complete his point. All right. Yes. What surrounds the atom? Sorry. What surrounds the atom? What? What surrounds the atom? It is the quantum fluctuations. Okay. So the quantum fluctuations are what? Just like the latest. It's field. So you know there is no particle. In fact, in fact, it is so coming no, from field. We have, have all pervading fields. Wait. Stop. All pervading fields. Do you know all pervading fields? Stop. 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 Just break it down very simple for the lay people. We have atoms. Okay. Now, what atoms made of? You want to be talking about quantum mechanics in the lecture? Wait, no, 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 no. <laughs> we have full time. Sorry, 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 right? brother, brother. We have full time. Do we have understanding Wait, of real time? Stop, stop, stop. Yes, sorry. We, we, have, we have photons, right? Yes. What are photons That's made? the problem. Photon no, is right not made of, of anything. Photon is photon. It is a proof. No, no, no. Photon is the fluctuation or part emission in the electromagnetic field. It is a drop. Now, this is a drop. Now, let's say that the photon exists in superposition, right? There's some, there's some undetermined thing about the photon. We don't know precisely where it is. Only we only know. Do you know what does the superposition means? Yeah. Superposition means that it is every. I mean, it is existing in every possibility everywhere. Yeah. And if you if you about to knowledge, take the about position, about knowledge, about knowledge. it is nothing to do with the knowledge. It is it is the knowledge. It is the fact. 
It has nothing to do with your description of measurement. It is the the reality. Yes. Yes. Quantum. Yes. What is? What is have, have you understood? Yes. 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 That's what he just said. He told me. So I deal specific. with quantum field theory, relativistic quantum yeah, field theory. You know. So when you're speaking to so a specialist in the subject, I am. I just have the humility. I don't know. Yes, I don't care. If, it's, if you, you don't know, care? I don't care. You know, you're, 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 you're telling me something. You have no knowledge of something you're talking about. So you are, you are using quantum mechanics, and you do not understand. I'm understanding of quantum mechanics. You are understanding of quantum mechanics. You are, you are trying to understand quantum reality in terms of a classical view. Up your he made a point about quantum mechanics. I told him it's false. Then the physicist came in, Muslim, who was showing him he's wrong. We're talking past each other. We're talking past each other. No, no, you have to talk past each other. What's that? What's he said? What's he said? I'll explain afterwards. Do you care about the established knowledge? Do you care about the established knowledge? Do you care about the established knowledge? I'm the one to be arrogant. Show some humility. You show some humility. Come, 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 come. My friend, my friend, my friend. My friend, let me just speak out. I made a point. No, 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 I haven't. I haven't. Shall I tell you why? 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 I use... Okay, let's Speak to him. Why are you scared of him? I'm scared of him. No, no. Speak to him. Because you're not letting him speak. You're not letting him speak. I have said to a unicorn is equal to a unicorn. That is... You do not understand a unicorn is a unicorn. It is a true statement. Self-conscious statement. I'm not being real. I can't understand. You are arguing a modal... Modal... Modal logic kind of thing. So you are arguing about self consistency of a statement. I don't know. You know? Do you saying. understand the self consistency no, of a no, statement? I'm a, no, I'm a bit. Shut. Up. Okay. If you don't interrupt him, maybe you can understand no, what I he's can't saying. Understand the okay, okay, okay. Fine, fine. Please speak, speak okay, again. Sorry. sorry. It's not so the do accent. You no, I'm, no, I'm sorry. I'm, 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 okay. Do you Why can I understand it? Why can everyone else understand it? So can they? You, can they? You well, are, no. You are his mate who from before. That doesn't count. That doesn't count. All right, fine. When he speaks, you are. You are. Okay. You are arguing about. Let him speak. Let him speak. You are arguing about the self consistency of a statement and possibility do you understand that the self consistency of, of a statement of what? a statement that entails or describes a possibility we do hard for him okay say, no, say it, i know no say i know say the words do you understand how understand. logical possibilities how logical possibilities are inferred do I understand how, how do logical you, possibilities are inferred? Yes. Okay, so it's going to be a particular modal like philosophy. That yes. 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 So that's why I was talking about you. So set the mean, criteria of self consistency. I can't you said. I'm setting criteria. I'll, I'll repeat it. He said the criteria of self consistency is what you came up with. Okay. So I'm going to take. There, there I so, said that a unicorn is equal to a unicorn. So it is a self consistent go, statement. So look, the reason, yeah. look, the, wait, hold on. The reason why he brought you in this debate is Sorry. because the reason why he brought you in this debate is because he said that quantum mechanics goes against logic. Now, I, what we perceive to be, okay, uh, no, what, what we perceive in quantum okay, okay, mechanics okay, okay. goes against okay. what we believe logically. Okay, okay, okay. I didn't so, say it disproves logic. Okay, okay, I don't believe okay. that. So Logic okay, prevails okay, quantum so mechanics. It's just, a, it's just an equivocation. I thought you were talking about logic in philosophy. You listed my intuition. I don't disagree. Quantum mechanics does go against intuition. Yeah, but you were making statements which he fact-checked on no, you. No, 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 no. Wait, Listen, wait, talk wait, to him, talk to him. Let me live quantum mechanics. Now, I am... I'm, just quantum mechanics. Let, 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 let me speak, please. No, no, listen. If you interrupt him, then you say, I don't understand him because of his accent. Let me speak. And you scrutinize your self-consistence verification. I mean, I have to verify how you are able or how you are so good in establishing the self-consistency in a thing. And qualify or, I mean, identify a possible thing. Let me say that a unicorn is equal to a unicorn. What? A unicorn, 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 unicorn is equal to a unicorn. Is it, is it a statement? Is it a statement? Is it, is it a statement? Is it, is it self-consistent? What is that? Self-consistent. What is that? A unicorn is equal to a unicorn. What do you mean? I need to know what kind of sense you mean. Okay, okay. No. Is, okay, is, look, look, I don't know why you're trying to get around what he's saying. He's saying a unicorn is a unicorn. Maybe you can understand my accent. A unicorn is a unicorn. Is that self-consistent? Is the statement self-consistent? Are, are, are you saying you're saying the properties of a unicorn are identical to the properties of a unicorn? Yes. No, no. Yes? Yes. You said no. Which one? No, no, no. Sorry, a I don't know. That no, that no, you guys no. are confusing. Which one? Okay. A I'm unicorn is a properties. unicorn. Is that is that consistent? Yes or Without no? Without going to properties, a unicorn is equal to you know whatever be the property. Okay, I don't know what you're talking about. Unicorn has properties. What are you talking about? So they are they are 
he was talking about regression and time. So time and cause and effect has properties. You know, and you are washing out these properties and imposing your own meaning and claiming that self consciousness. So, no, no, you, know, you, you if you are talking about time and cause, then you have some property of time and cause. I haven't removed any properties. You don't know what you're talking about. Come on, come on. Let me ask you, let me ask you very simply. This is what he said, okay? In quantum mechanics, do some no, of the things I, that are. Let me leave ask quantum you mechanics. Question. Leave quantum mechanics no, no. from where The only reason why me and you are talking right now is because he yeah. thought you knew something about quantum mechanics, which I deny. Let's talk about that and then we go back to it. So, because our debate is meaningless. Has already been, been our debate is meaningless. Let Look, let you if you agree with me, then we're done our debate because we're not debating about anything. In quantum mechanics, are some of the things that we come to know in quantum mechanics unintuitive? Yes or no? What? Are they unintuitive? No, repeat the sentence. In quantum mechanics, are there some truths we, we are finding quantum mechanics which are unintuitive? Yes. That's it. Done. So that, what was I saying that See, you that you disagree with me I on? I thought you said that they contradict logic, and I and I, we clarified to me. Okay, let me tell you something. Quantum logic prevails quantum mechanics. That's my view. Yeah, but we don't disagree. That's what I'm saying. No, that was, no. That's what I'm saying. It's a qualification. No, it's meaning. No, 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 no. So, 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 let me say that. Logic, no, we agree, no, no, we agree, no, no. we agree. Logic, we logic, agree. logic, we agree. logic, logic, logic depends on what you start with. What you start with. So in quantum mechanics, in illogical, if you hold the classical no, view. We're talking about axioms. If you hold the mechanics. I'm talking about like, for example, law of identity, law of exclude in middle, law of, oh, sorry, law of contradiction. I'm just talking about the classical laws of logic are not contradicted by quantum mechanics. We just have particular notions about what we expect for particular like measurements and stuff. Like That's that. a belief, by the way. Yeah, Although yeah. I believe in no, what you're yeah, saying, it's I still agree, a belief. I agree, we don't disagree. We no, agree. no, 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 I, 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 I should say that you take uh, the no, experiment, no, no, the, the, you take the sequential Stangal experiment, result of sequential Stangal experiment. We can, no, no, you can, you can go through the MIT open course in MIT open course of quantum mechanics one there is the available superposition about superposition we are talking about there you get that how your logical sense gets bashed I mean I don't know. destroyed so you do not know your your intuitions are challenged I agree that's not nothing to do with logic and no that's, then, that's intuition that's nothing to do with logic no, no, even for example, look, I have particular intuitions about the world, for example. I expect that when I get on a plane, the plane's going to get up and it's going to land. That's got nothing to do with logic. Okay. You see, you see, you see the point? We're not wait, talking wait, wait, about wait, it. Are you separating intuition from logic totally? No, so intuitions are going to be, for example, like intellectual impressions we have on particular things. So, for example, like, let's say I take a particular proposition. Now, one of, like, let's say I take the proposition, um, you've been to a different country, right? Or you're from a different country. I'm gonna say, based off all of the things I see about you, my my my, my first into like uh, my first intellectual intuitions is that that's probably true. Now let's just say for example it's false. Well then yeah, my intuitions will be false. Okay. That's got nothing to do okay. with logic. I'm in that, in that so example. why why don't we do it this way? Why don't you explain to us? And this is an interesting point which is gonna help us. Which why don't disagree? No, I think we are disagreeing because I disagree with you separating intuition and logic. Look, so there are going to be some... And now be, I can start look, to see why we are disagreeing on other points there's too. There's going to be some axiomatic foundational things. By the way, I am a foundation about justification. I'll be just trying to like talk about different things. There are going to be some... Oh, wait, 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 wait a second. I'm at, wait, wait, wait. Come on, man. <laughs> I'm at, Come on, man. Am, so you're telling am, me we, we both am. come from the same school of thought. I, I agree. About, so I agree what's wrong with the first cause argument for God then? Oh, the first cause argument... Oh, wait, so... So which one? Because there's, there's Aristotle's one. There's Aristotle's one. Thomas Aquinas. So Aristotle's one. From my, on my view, I think first of all, it doesn't show how. I think one of the biggest things is the um. Uh, what's it called again? It's like the modal quantum. I can't believe you actually believe this. <laughs> yeah, yeah because I like Aristotle. That shows the guy. Yeah, man. Quite, quite. But like um. Yeah. One of the things is that it's, it's going to be uh, uh, what is it? attributes. It's, it's like a fallacy of composition. So in my view, it, it, it seems to me like, for example, let's say, let's say, let's say I were to accept the contingency argument, it would not entail that there is one 
necessary being for all chain, for all contingent chains. It does not entail that. It's perfectly possible for there to be multiple, for example, prime movers of different uh, chains of contingency. The argument of cont the contingency argument put forth by Aristotle does not entail that there is one, literally one necessary non-contingent entity responsible for all the chains of contingency. But it also, the argument also doesn't talk about God being omni know, omnipotent know, know, or loving no, no, no. or... I know, but that, that's the argument. The argument, was, the argument was to put forth that all the chains of contingency end in a prime mover. But that doesn't follow. It can end, yeah, cha a chain of contingency, I can even agree that it's valid, I just don't think it's sound. It's, it's going to be true. Wait, 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 wait. Why is it valid but not sound? Oh, because it's not true, but it, but it does follow. But why is it not true? Oh, because I, because it's no contradiction. You see, because the thing, look, the thing is that Aristotle, and he may not have known it, but that argument is going to deny causal affinity. That was the point, right? That was the point. So that his he argument, was saying that his argument is going to deny if it is not self-contradictory, that possibility is valid. That's yeah, why yeah. I said that unicorn is equal to unicorn. <laughs> I don't know. That possibility is sorry. I'm saying that, I'm saying that is self-contradictory. No, no, no. He, he, no, look, he, look, 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 look. Okay, you're making the point that for something to be impossible, you have to show there's a contradiction. Well, no, not that you have to show it, but it has to be a contradiction. The reason why things are impossible okay. is that they entail contradiction. His counterpoint to that is it's logically consistent to say a unicorn is a unicorn. Okay. Right? Now, there's no contradiction in that statement Follow on from this because yeah. I don't. Yeah, yeah. Oh, no, I, I, I'm trying to get him to complete this point. Possibility of existing unicorn is a valid possibility. Oh yeah. So you're confused about. Ah, yeah. I see. I see. Yeah, I see. Yeah, yeah, so, yeah. So, yeah, yeah. See, answer that. So yeah, he's confused about epistemology and ontology. Now, a unicorn being a unicorn is an ontological. Thing. Now, it, it possibly being real is an is an epistemological thing. Those two things. That's what I was saying about the bus. No, no, no. The, the bus. About the bus, no, I was only interested. You were talking about ontology. I was talking about epistemology. No, 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 no. You're talking talk about what's possible, no, 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 no. right? No, 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 no. The bus example is an epistemological statement because you're talking about modal logic. Right. So he's confusing ontology and epistemology. So let's go back. Look, hold on. Let's go back to the original and my problems with the other. My main problem with the other is that it, so it's a modal quantifier shift. That's the, that's the original thing. So it does not it does not mean that just because there is, for example, a necessary being that is responsible for at least one chain of contingent things, that that entails that a mode that a necessary being is responsible for all chains of contingency. That's the that's that's one of my responses. Second, we never had no, that no, argument. No, no, no. No, that's the, that's the, that's no, no, the, no, look, no, 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 listen, 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 we've had a better conversation, but no, no. Ali Dobbs wait, wait, so, so wait, 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 one second, Sorry. does that mean, mean you don't actually disagree with the bus example? Oh, no, we do, because you're saying that it is impossible, I'm saying if it's impossible, then it has to be a contradiction. contradiction, okay, so here's, here's my question to you, why is it, and I still don't get it, despite you just saying, oh, it's a um, model logic or whatever, why is it that for something to be impossible, you have to show there's a contradiction? Why? Oh, so, so you're making a claim. You're saying that there is a state of affairs in the world such that X does not obtain. Now, the only reason why X cannot obtain is because either X is false. So like, for example, one plus one being three, that's just going to be false. So that statement, the truth of that statement is always going to be false. That's not going to obtain. Or that it just, it just entails a contradiction. Like, for example, there are, there's a tree in front of me and there's not a tree in front of me. That's just going to entail a contradiction. Th those, two, those, two, those two things are exhaustive. There isn't another way in which uh, uh, something that exists, so, or something proposed to exist, cannot obtain. Oh, now, you have not wait, justified wait, that wait, wait, point. Wait, wait, hold on, so I'm saying it's exhaustive. It's only those two options. Either it's false or it tells a contradiction. That's exhaustive. If we can agree on that, we can move on. Okay? I'm saying simply this. Let's You're not just saying that it's false. No, no. You're not just saying, you're saying it's metaphysically impossible for any chain of contingent things to not end, or not, sorry, to not begin with a necessary being. Now I'm saying, if that's true, and that's your premise, that's begging the question. Because that's your, that's your conclusion. Your conclusion is that there is a God, and God is the prime mover of all contingent chains. But that was your very premise. That's begging the question. I don't know but, where but this no. multiple chains came in from, because we weren't discussing no, no, that from no, the beginning. This is what, we were only talking about one no, chain. No, 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 no. Yeah, in the one chain, in one chain. That's the point. We're saying that God is responsible for at least one chain. 
of things. I'm saying, I believe all change, okay, but yeah. yeah, exactly. So you're saying at least one change. So this this this, this critique still falls through. You still have you still have yet to deal with this critique. No, no, no. Wait a minute. You're shifting the burden I'm to me when I've off. asked you. Yes, I've asked yes. you. For justification, no, 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 on, that Just, for something wait, to be shown quickly. to be impossible, you have to show a contradiction. Very, very How? Quickly, very quickly. You asked me what are my reasons to make. By the way, by the way, just, just, just to be very clear, I believe it is sufficient to show a contradiction to show something is impossible, but it's not necessary that you have to show a contradiction to show something is impossible. So I said there's two ways. You can show that it's false. Okay. So do you disagree with what I said? No. no. Oh, you so, don't. So, so, no, so but, where but, do we no, disagree? No, you are saying no, no. But you are saying it's impossible. I am. And impossibilities entail contradictions. Not necessarily. How? Show me I how. believe some things are purely uh, impossible from a practical point of view. Explain. If I want to shoot up a bullet to the sky, it's a, I can say it's impossible. It's impossible for that bullet to go to Jupiter. I don't have to show a contradiction in that. I can just show that. Wait, velocity wait, and, and, and mass and I can use some equations and show so that's that. going to contradict for example physical laws yeah. exactly so well, actually no 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 actually 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 wait, 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 wait a second you're right you're right there so so it, let me let me let me come up let me come up with another let me come up let, let me come up with another let me come up with another example because what, what I'm trying to do is I'm trying to show I got going like five minutes okay that's fine I'm trying to come up with an example for something Okay, your claim is categorical. For anything to be impossible, to show to be impossible, there has to be a contradiction. Okay? It's impossible for there to be world peace. No. Say, say I, make the, I make the statement, it's impossible for there to be world peace. Okay? We're not talking about the truth value of that statement. There is no truth value to that statement right now. You can say... No, wait, wait, wait. That's a claim, that's an ontological claim about the nature Sorry. of the planet. Sorry. So wait, 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 wait. No, no, no. Listen, one second, one second. It's impossible for there to be world peace. I am not making a truth claim. You're not making a truth claim. Okay. Is that same in No, no, no. I'm saying provisionally. I'm, I'm making a statement. Provisionally. Say someone makes a statement. You're saying... In order for them to justify their statement, they have to show a logical contradiction. That would just be Why? False. Why? So, so look, they're, look, they're saying that there can never be a way in which reality is that obtains that world peace could never exist. That's a no, it does not exist. Statement. Does not exist. Yeah. Yeah. No, could never exist. No, they're saying it's impossible. Could never exist. Okay. Now, before that to be true, they would need to show how all of the negation, all of the negating propositions are false. No, they now, don't. Of course they do. No, they don't. Of course they do. They let's don't. say, for example, like let's say, look, let's say for example, someone said, well, no, actually, look, I think that's a defeater for you. It's not. So look, defeaters are perfect. There's actually different types of defeaters. I'm sure you're aware. There's the butting defeaters, and it's undercut, and it's undercutting. Them. So there are reasons to think that something is, is, is true. And I think that... Wait, 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 wait. Sorry, sorry. Wait, one second, one second, one second. I agree with you. So look, but reasons is not to show non-contradictions so, always. Wait, wait, hold on, hold on. Very, very you've just, actually, very, very you've very just made a point very, I was saying before. Very quickly, very quickly. Impo I, and I, I, just, I just realized something. Impossibility, Did you word that wrong then? Yeah, impossibility can only be taken in a moral sense. When they say, oh, I think it's impossible. Uh, I, think what, I think what the person's really saying is that they think it's really unlikely. But, but in, you're changing the example. I know, but in modal logic, we just don't use the word impossibility. We're talking about states of affairs that can occur or cannot occur necessarily. Now, that's what I'm saying. Necessarily, anything that cannot occur metaphysically Can I, okay. is going to entail a contradiction. Let me, let me make a statement. It's going to be definition. Let me give you a statement. If I take the Hobbesian view of human nature and I say world peace is not possible because ultimately we are at rock bottom, red in tooth and claw. Okay? And then I give you a whole bunch of empirical evidence from evolutionary psychology about our human nature. I am giving you evidence and reason and justification apart from showing contradictions. So, guess what? Huh? So, 
Hobbs now, I don't, I'm not, I'm not particularly, yeah, I'll particularly. Yeah, I'll come with you guys. So Hobbs, in that instance, is still not making a metaphysical claim. Okay. Ah, okay. He's making a logical claim. Okay. He's making a logical claim. Okay, okay. He's not making a metaphysical claim. Okay, he's making a logical claim. I'm talking about modality. Okay, okay. He's, okay. he's, he's making, he's about, making a logical claim. So, but say he's making a metaphysical claim now. Oh, well, oh, that, oh, so, okay. So if he's making a metaphysical claim, yeah. then he's saying the very nature yeah. of a person is necessarily X. Yeah. Now, if I were to prove that the very nature of a person is necessarily Y, but well, that's a contradiction. And it's also false. Yeah, but Hobbes doesn't need to provide evidence. Sorry. No, he, no, no, all no, Hobbes, no, sorry, no, no, sorry, he just wouldn't tell a contradiction. Sorry, sorry, sorry. No, no, all, Hob forget, forget look, look, all Hobbes has to do is forget. to show what human nature is. Yeah. He doesn't have to show that there's a contradiction for wait, world wait, peace. Wait, wait, on, do you get my point? I know you're saying, you're saying, but we're not talking about the same thing anymore. I'm talking about net, we're talking about... I think your definition I'm of same thing is a bit I'm not, I'm not talking same about thing. like this like colloquial, I think like flying cars are impossible. That's not what I'm talking about. I'm talking about things that. So I'm, I'm talking about, I'm talking so about metaphysical as well. Now. Talking about, no, you're talking about things that like. So, no, Hobbes. Okay, wait, 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 one second. One, one second, one second. Sorry. Human nature can be described in metaphysical terms. Yeah, but. The, Do you wait, agree with that? Yeah, wait, so an wait, argument. Wait, wait, an argument. Not modal terms. No one, no one is. No one is who cares? Who cares? As in, why does it have to be always in the modal framework? Why? Because remember, we're talking about. Because look, what is necessary? Look, something is necessary insofar as it exists in all possible ways. Okay, you could make metaphysical claims about human nature and metaphysical claims about the nature of international relations and human beings going to war. You can make these types of things, despite you not being able to show that there's a contradiction in terms of world well, peace. Look, I'm going to simply say this: if they're talking about it in a modal sense. And by the way, one, one, one last thing. <laughs> I hardly see where we are disagreeing when it comes to the infinite regress example. I still don't see all, it. All I'm saying is that the reason why, for example, a squared circle can never obtain is because it entails a contradiction. It's literally metaphysically impossible. Yes. And me, you're not disagreeing. But why are you taking that so, as evidence for everything? Oh, oh, that's oh, that's just my modal axiom that I follow. Okay, I can say I reject that. I can say I'm, I don't follow, I don't believe in that. Okay, but well then you haven't convinced me of the contradiction. No, that oh, that's fine. But okay, but here's the, point. the whole point is that no, I came no, no, here. No, 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 Ali Dawa said, "Look, I, I'm going I to show you." Okay, the okay, is wrong. okay. Do you know what? He doesn't know he's talking. Okay, about. okay. He gave me an argument. Okay, do you know what? Show me how. Okay, but when you come from a particular modal school of thought, then you can say I reject this argument. But that doesn't mean that that argument is categorically defeated by you holding on to that particular modal school of thought. I never said that. I'm okay. saying these are the reasons why I reject it. Okay. That's it. Okay. No, actually, I, I, I want to make a point. I actually understand I what actually, you're saying, actually, do but you know I disagree with it. Yeah, of course, do you come to the point? Do you have to move forward into the debate about the legality of what particular axiom you accept? Are you ever have reasons okay. my sorry, sorry, sorry. Are you ever about the wave particle duality? Wave particle duality. Wave, wave particle oh, duality. That's the double space. Yeah, 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 um, photons are waves and particles. Yeah. And anti commutation. <laughs> anti commutation. Anti commutation. Two things do not commute. Two, two things do not commute. So much. Commute, commute in the sense they can, cannot measure uh, certainty at the same time. Oh, I'm, I'm not a fan of huh? this. Yeah, yeah. No, I'm not saying. I'm saying. So you, you are I saying thought that he was saying is the infinite regress right. is wrong triangle. categorically, but he's what saying under his model logic. Square triangle. That's where we were miscommunicating. But it's interesting something, what he says about multiple chains. I mean, you prove that it's only one. Do you believe in tau? At the same time, which is what, the oneness of God. We would say everything which is contingent. Explain Sorry? Explain contingent. Is that dependent on It has limitations. Exists at the same time. We believe you can't have two all-powerful so, beings so, so if we break down the argument. That's why I'm saying It's impossible to have two all-powerful beings. So you cannot have all contingent things going back to um, multiple because two all-powerful gods, one, 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 that's a contradiction, 
So uh, one will limit the other. So there has to be one all powerful. Yeah, two half powerful so bunch. They're not got. Okay, we'll replace the word. Yeah, we're going. We're going. Yeah. He's just saying that. So his, his argument is is modality, which I don't I don't understand. Fundamental concept. I don't agree with this school of thought. It doesn't make any sense. In all cases, at once, why taking some measures? Do you know string theory? They are actually you. I'm headed off. All possible. What's your name? Rico, what's your name? You, 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 you take all possible, possible geometry of the space. What's your name? You know? You all possible geometry. You are taking not Yeah, yeah, just definitely. Just not. Yeah, yeah. And you say that you, you take. You'll have an infinite you regress of claims going back forever. Same thing. I've got to go and like What in unpossibility? Just very quickly. You quantum mechanics. Right? We're trying yeah. to study the quantum rules, right? Yeah. So trying to measure things in quantum No, you said that, brother Sabu said that in some reality that can be possible. You, you denied that. So you, you said that this triangle and circle in, in some possibility. No, no. Okay, so, so ju just to summarize where we disagree. He believes that in order for something to be impossible, you have to show a contradiction. And that's according to his modal school of thought. I don't subscribe to that, which is why we will be an impasse. We will never agree. Yes, yes. Not necessarily you have to show contradiction. It's not that you have to show it, but that it just wouldn't be it just would be a terror. Yeah. Like, I don't see any but reason that, to but that given that it's given that, that nuance I hope we came up with in the beginning because that's why we can't uh, see eye to eye with this example. Actually finding finding a contradiction is itself a, a, a subjective think, thing sometimes. Possible, for example, finding a contradiction is also a subjective thing. For example, like metaphysically speaking, from to, for Moses to speak the same. Yes. Me too. Because there's no contradiction. Yeah. That's what I'm saying. No, that's, uh, that's why it's possible. Yeah. Like, let's say, for example, it was just like, there was like a logical law, and the logical law was that no no uh, Israelites can spit seeds. Yeah. But that would be a con No law exists. Yeah. That's why I think it's possible. Yeah. But no law exists stating that there can be an indifferent yeah. regression. So, you know, this whole time, I thought you were saying that it's incoherent for me to believe in an infinite regress. Uh, in that argument, but you were just saying under your modal school, you have to show a contradiction, and in this case, you don't have to accept this example. Now I understand you better. Yes. I just don't see how it, how it can't occur. Because you're saying, oh, oh. But then I could I could just simply turn around and say I don't accept your modality, the, your way of thinking. You can say that, but you are not just saying. You also are saying that it is impossible. No, I'm, not, say, I'm saying. I'm saying that's No, no now, now, the next time we debate, it should be about. Why is that modal school the categorically correct one? Oh, well, most philosophers accept all of the modal axioms, well, as, at least I, I, from my knowledge, all of philosophers. If you philosophers don't agree with anything, Wait, hold on. <laughs> Come on, you know that. Least, look, you know that, least, I know that. At least in modal logic. He's smiling, he knows. The only, look, look, the only yeah. controversial modal axiom is the S5 axiom. Right, that's the only and that's the one you subscribe to. That's, and that's the one you subscribe to, and that's the controversial one. But most people, actually, you know what? It's a very good conversation. It's actually a very good conversation. I can imagine with a two-hour conversation, I'm never good. Yeah, but it's great. It's great speaking to you. I didn't run away. You stayed. No, no, you didn't, didn't run away. It's great speaking to you guys. Yeah, see you later. It's great speaking to you. Guys. What's this? What's this?